think that this class was really um, a fundamental part of this team this year and kind of creating this winning culture um, and I think the culture of Stanford softball for the years to come after this. I think the senior class has just taught me a lot about selflessness um, because Molly, Frosty, Seeley, and Whitney have always just been there for the team um, in whatever way possible. They're always on the fence cheering. They're always putting in work. If I could be anywhere near as good and wonderful as any of the seniors, that would be, that's the goal. There's no age difference, it seems. They make everyone feel at home. They make everyone feel like their best friends. They lead by their actions and their words and they align. And I think that just their legacy will be like who they are as people and the impact they left both on and off the field. All the seniors were super welcoming when I came in. Um, I'm really close with uh, all of them, especially Molly and Frosty. Uh, they're very, they're very funny. We all have like similar humor. All of them collectively have such a calming presence and me and my class definitely get very stressed out um, about all the little things and they help calm us down. They, on the field, have really done a good job of just getting us as a group and playing Stanford softball and not, not trying to be anything that we aren't and really embodying um, what it means to be and be a part of the whole Stanford legacy. Their willingness to show up each day and work as hard as they possibly can is, sets the tone for our entire team and it really makes the rest of the team want to be, have that same sort of motivation. They all have traits of resiliency and they just, they all are very level, they just keep working and they all trust that it's going to work out. I've seen them grow throughout these past few years and so showing their ability to learn has given us something to look up to and something to aspire to be. All of them just exude this um, like excitement and competitiveness for the game that's just um, really exciting to watch. Even though they've been here for so long, as Whitney always says, she's been here half a decade, um, they just, they never quit and they just always have a big smiles on their face and I'm gonna really miss that. I will miss all of their personalities. They all have such like vibrant and lovely personalities. Each of them have their own thing that makes them who they are. I'm gonna miss the little quiet moments before a game starts with them when they're just cracking jokes to relieve the tension. And I'm gonna miss all the late nights of studying and the other late nights of just talking about life. They have been uh, the most influential people in my life these past couple of years and it's gonna be hard to let them go. All four of the seniors over these last couple of years have just exhibited what it means to have a heart for the sport, um, but more importantly, what it looks like to have a heart for those around us. Um, their work ethic on and off the field is something that's so special and so beautiful and it's really awesome to have those seniors to look up to as our role models. I hope that people, you know, when they remember our senior class that they always felt welcomed and that they felt supported. Um, I think that that's something that is really important, especially in the older classes, is to, you know, really take care of everybody around you. Um, and I hope that that's something that they felt and that they felt welcomed within the program and that, you know, the, the, that we were somebody that they could look up to, um, to go out there and, and whatever they needed that we would be able to help give it to them. The thing I'm gonna miss the most is definitely just being around everybody every day and you know, having those friends that you can reach out to at any point in time and you know they have your back and having people that go through the same struggles as you every day and like I said, work hard with you every day and to not have those directly in my corner. You know, I know they'll always have my back, but It'll be different. It'll be different to be separated from it all, but I know that they're lifelong friends. I know a lot of people say that like the best thing about Stanford is the people because they do a really good job of like getting the most intelligent minds in the world and like the best uh, people in their field in their sport. Um, and so I think that all of my like favorite moments have come around like either meeting someone that was really cool and learning um, exactly why they got into Stanford. So like what was their thing that they're so good at, and it, it extends to like my teammates and in the same way that it's like you come here and we've all played softball but we all have different personalities and we all have something to bring to the table and I think that's really special. If everyone can identify that winning is the most important thing and that's frankly what we're all here to do um, and to do what's best for the program and what's best for the team and your teammates around you, um, putting the team first and just finding a way to win no matter what I hope is the legacy that we've left behind here.